Arthur E. Drum. Arthur E. Drum, December 6, 1929, May 26, 2014, was an American inventor, environmentalist, military subcontractor, and industrialist of the modern street sweeping broom industry, as well as a publisher. Biography Born in Marisville, Ohio, Arthur was one of 14 brothers and sisters, the son of Francis Drum, of Bavarian origin, and Evelyn Warner. Raised during the Great Depression, he worked on his father's farm from a very young age, graduated from Marisville High School in 1948, and then joined the Marine Corps. He achieved the rank of Staff Sergeant before his discharge. Discharge. Stationed in San Francisco, he would meet his wife, Roberta Bumpus, whom he married in Reno, Nevada in 1952. Returning home, he would earn an apprenticeship in machinery and would manage his own farm in Marisville until his thirties while raising his young daughters. Industrial Brooms Drum would become involved in the industrial broom industry. Industrial brooms became an emerging conservation product in the twentieth century as the world moved toward more environmentally friendly practices. They remove harmful substances and pollutants from the roads that would otherwise drain off into vegetation and slash or water sources, or be continually carried and pushed around by vehicles and other street traffic. They add longevity to asphalt through cleansing and preventing early decay. This in turn cuts down on the environmentally harmful practices of consistently paving and the manufacturing of toxic asphalt. They prevent flooding by collecting debris that would accumulate and block storm drains. Marisville Rotary Broom Service, Inc. In 1964, Drum started Marisville Rotary Broom Service, Inc., in his machine shop, which was on the property of his home and farm. He would sell locally and regionally through word of mouth. In the late 1960s, he would develop a machine which made the manufacturing of wafer brooms cheaper and faster through a mechanical process versus the old manual process. This gave the business an advantage, and production increased dramatically. By the 1970s, the company had become a notable player in the industry, selling nationally and worldwide. Drum would obtain several more U.S. patents in the years to come, which included intellectual property for core mounting assemblies, sweeper brushes, rotary broom core assemblages, spiral brushes, and brush bristle units. The machine shop drum had started and eventually would be transformed into a modern factory through additions and new construction during this period. The company reached its pinnacle under drum by the mid minus 1980s. It was attracting attention from all over with various interests, including being featured on the local Columbus WBNS TV evening news in a story about Reaganomics and the successful impact it was having locally on the economy with businesses. For personal reasons, Drum would let go of Marisville Rotary Broom Service, Inc., eventually being bought out in 1985 by Dick Savage. Kennedy Brush Savage's other industrial broom manufacturing company and Marisville Rotary Broom Service, Inc., would merge in 1990 to form United Rotary Brush. Drum Industries Shortly after he sold Marisville Rotary Broom Service, Inc., in 1988 he would receive a patent for a push broom head of the channel mounted bristle type. He would then focus a considerable amount of time innovating a replaceable strip brush. This changed the whole process of manufacturing two brooms, as one too could be recycled simply by replacing the brush through replaceable slide on strips versus the old method of wrapping the brush around the tube, welding it together, and shipping the tube back for a replacement wrap when it was worn out, or scrapping the tube altogether. Drum would obtain several patents relating to the strip brush innovation. Drum Industries would eventually be sold to Sweepster in 1999. Real Estate and Publishing At the time of his passing in 2014, Drum's real estate portfolio was valued at one dollar one cent million. Through the years he owned 15,785 U.S. 36, which was sold to form the original Marisville, while Mart Shopping Center, 
337 Main Saint in Russell's Point, home to his Indian Lake Publishing Company, a venture with his wife and daughter which published the Indian Lake Beacon, and written by her and his son-in-law, Family, Retirement and Death. Following retirement, Drum would spend time with his family traveling, and at his home on Orchard Island, Ohio, he enjoyed feeding deer and squirrel. Arthur Drum died in 2014 in his hometown of Marisville on Memorial Day. His wife, Roberta, died July 28, 2014 in Fayetteville, Georgia. They are survived by three daughters, six grandchildren, and three great-grandchildren. Custom Augers In 2004, he was issued patent along with his son-in-law, which improved an auger boring device. This invention is celebrated as progress in the history cited in a patent obtained in 2007 by another individual. The groundbreaking product was part of a joint venture he became involved with called Custom Augers. Military Honors The Drum family was honored by the Union County OH Veterans Remembrance Committee on Veterans Day, 2008, where a ceremony was held at the Veterans Memorial in Marisville, honoring the family's military service. He was a member of the American Legion Union Post 79. Equals equals references equals equals equals.